Hey guys, I am back and I brought with me Batman the Telco series, The Enemy Within. And this is season two of Batman the Telco series, but it's The Enemy Within. So let's jump right into this. Okay, so just like in Minecraft story mode, it's telling us to uh, continue story or use default choices. I'm going to continue my story. Who did you save when did you attack? I saved Henry. You spend the night with Selena? Yes. And Gotham was on attack. Who do you chase down? I chased down the penguin. When John Doe was chasing that. How did you react? I ran through the phone. Did you owe John the Joker a favor? I think I... I think I refused. As friend. So down that. Did you reveal your identity to protect him? Yeah, I did. I said I was going to end it with Batman, and I ended with Batman. The story is complete. Okay, let's get right into this. Okay, episode one is called The Enigma. I think that's how they pronounce it. Episode two is called the p the pit the nah, patch. Episode three is called break trip. Uh, I'm not going to announce all those. At episode four and episode five is called Saint Stitch. So let's begin with episode one, shall we? One fateful night, my parents gave their lives for me. They became my heroes, their legacy untouchable. Until I learned the truth. My father, Thomas Wayne, was a criminal. He ruled over Gotham from the shadows. And everything I thought I knew about myself changed forever. The children of Arkham exposed the truth about my father to Gotham. Their attack turned friends into enemies and threw the city into chaos. I was committed to Arkham Asylum, where I escaped with the help of a mental patient named John Doe. After a bloody battle, I put an end to it all in the catacombs beneath the city. The Penguin, Two-Face, and Lady Arkham were the first real challenge I faced as the Batman, but they would not be the last. Okay. Spring has arrived in Gotham, and with it comes City Hall's quarterly crime report. Crime is way down since the fall of the children of Arkham, marking another triumph for newly minted police commissioner, James Gordon. In a statement this morning, Gordon credited his success to the public partnership between the police and the Batman. He praised the mysterious vigilante for his sacrifice, describing him as essential to the security of the city. Things are looking up, citizens. After the long, dark winter <laughs> comes the thaw. Now, if only the Knights could win a game, everyone Is would be happy. Is that the riddle? Lucky 13! There it is. Rumi Mori, import-export magnet, one-time Pipex CEO, international arms dealer. The world sees Mori as a legitimate businessman, a philanthropist who gives to charity, not a criminal getting rich off the suffering of innocence, a masterful performance. And there's our man, Bruce Wayne, a.k.a. Batman. That long, does he forget who he really is? What do you think, Master Bruce? Must be hard to stay true to yourself. 
I don't. I never forget what drives me. Protecting the innocent from people like Mori. That stays the same no matter what mask I wear. Don't I know? Masks are hard to maintain. If there are cracks in Mori's, we'll find them. The GCPD well, already bugged his penthouse for that. nothing. Meaning well, that he's doing does his arms eyes do that more them. often. They happen on the casino floor. I need to find a way to hear what Mori is saying. Standing by for support. Look for something with a microphone. The bat computer okay, can intercept his communications. He certainly enjoys the good life, doesn't he? Made a fortune running guns during the Arab Spring. Diversified into biotech shortly after. From what I understand, he's not one for pinching pennies. Well, looks like roulette is his Achilles heel. He has a reputation for being lucky, but then you don't need luck when you own the house. Consumer model. Could be a good way to hear Maury's conversation. Al, I'm hacking into Maury's phone. Encrypting your signal. Last thing we want is for him to know you're here. We're in. You should be able to pick up audio from Maury's phone. Is everyone enjoying themselves? Don't worry. I won't tell anyone with a bad. He's on a roll. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before he gets too chatty. <laughs> Try to blend in. Does Batman still. Well, so, Bruce Wayne still has that cut in his heel. What's Bruce Wayne doing in a place like this? Oh, yeah, he does. Went to fancier casinos. Some place where only high rollers go. Don't tell anyone, but uh, I'm here undercover. Don't worry. I can keep a secret. You? What in the hell are you doing here? Stop me if you've heard this one before. I begin and have no end. And I end all that begins. Who am I? I don't give a damn. I told you ten times. Our arrangement is over. Death, Mori. I am death. Something's happening, and it doesn't look like a deal. The man in the hood. I remember him from your father's time. I think that's Riddler. Oh, he is. He is the Riddler. Oh, no. Is something wrong? You seem distracted. Bruce. You think your gibberish intimidates Hello? him? Hello? You, uh, you can't just blow me off. Stay close and keep your head down. Excuse me? Bullets are about to fly. Okay. No one threatens me in my own casino. Security! Sir, it's time to leave. For you? An easy one. What question can you never answer yes to? I don't give a crap, let's go. <sighs> Wrong. The correct answer is, are you dead? Oh! Whoa! Now, let's get started. Run now. But 
you did to that man. Knocking him out like that. How did you do that? I had a different impression of you from TV. You never seemed that capable. Yeah, I'm a man of many talents. That's... that's an understatement. Thank you. Commissioner Gordon on the line, scrambling audio now. Gordon. Batman, what's the status? Batman? <laughs> Batmobile. Multiple gunmen, hostages at the casino. A madman in a mask. Riddler's back in Gotham. Riddler? He hasn't been seen in years. Well, he's putting on quite a show. There's a squad on the way. They'll be there shortly. Be ready for a fight. So it looks like the riddle is back in town. I don't know about Riddle's backstory. Um, I need to look that up. Please, please, we can make the deal. Anything you want. Our issues can't be solved with handshakes, Maury. This is what happens when you back out of a deal with me. There's only one way you're getting out of this alive. You have to solve a riddle. And I choose my words carefully if I were you. Listen closely. No, he please, is like J don't Jigsaw. Do Without fingers, I point. Without arms, I strike. Without feet, I run. Who am I? I've got visual. That drone fully functional. I'll need a place He's to drop in. A psychopath. Time for some recon. And limbless freak. A mind bender that scratched. Riddler. A terror from the past. I never thought I'd see him on our streets again. He's not to be taken lightly. It's the kind of conundrum that drives you to distraction. Some kind of torture device. Doesn't seem like he's getting out until he guesses the riddle. This Riddler certainly has an imagination. For a moment's peace. Believe me, I know. Riddler's taken hostages, casino patrons, innocent bystanders. Uh, they're clearly not his main target. Must be an insurance policy. But don't think you can just stall. Hold on, guys. Okay, I. I think I put the subtitles on so y'all can understand what what they're Just saying. That'll do. Just yeah, need I to did. Take out the guard first. Audio playback fully functional. Time for a distraction. What the? Distraction. I'm Batman. I'm losing patience, Maury. Are you expecting a hint? Give me an answer. Okay, what am I supposed to do here? Batman, we can't get in. The front's covered by gunmen, and they've got the back barricaded with blackjack tables. How should I deploy when we're inside? I'm relying on your eyes and ears. What's the best course of action? We need a distraction. Find a way to limit their line of sight. Sounds like a plan. You, you're completely oh. insane! No. I don't believe that's it. Ah! Oh. Ah! I'll clear a path. Wait for my signal. Give him hell. We're counting on you. Uh, bash. Wham. Batman! 
You're ahead of schedule. I'm a little busy right now, but I'll see if I can fit you in. Not him, the hostage. Shoot the hostage. <gasps> oh no. You're not shooting anybody. Get open with pleasure. Oh, I'm using my head real clearly, and like you people. I've heard stories in the streets about you, Batman. You're the biggest name in Gotham since... Well... Since I left town. Everyone's very impressed with you. Oh. I'm not impressed. Well, you Gotham's don't have much criminals time left. become zealots and thugs in cheap suits. And you... I've come home to find a wannabe in my chair. Eating my goddamn porridge! This is my city! Now I'm back, and I'm taking what's mine. You don't know me, Riddler. You have no idea what you're up against. You must think you're so special. You're not the first hero I've put down. You're supposedly the world's greatest detective. Gordon, Yet here no. you are. to be kidding uh. clever but not smart enough let me show you how it was done back in the day away you broke the cage that's cheating think I care about your rules I'd heard you were a man who followed a code why would you save that dirtbag's life Maury made his money running guns trading off the suffering of war I believe in justice Maury deserves a trial in a court of law if he's guilty his cell will be right next to yours Justice. Ridiculous. Either way, you won't be the one to put me there.
Okay. Well, now it's him. Enough of this! You know how to scrap. I'll give you that. But it's not enough. Let's see how you do with something a little more cerebral. Better hurry, detective. Solve my puzzle soon. Or people are gonna get hurt. And we know you can't let that happen. Crush them. You should have called us before going in, Gordon. Waller? After all, we're here to help. Batman Detective Series. The, en the enemy within. Circuitry inside, but nothing obviously dangerous. The back computer will be able to analyze further. Your days are numbered, Bat Freak. We'll see each other again. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Keep one eye in the sky, jerk offs. Heavens are gonna fall on your goddamn heads! Tell me all about it, down at the precinct. The Riddler's right hand in custody? Not a bad result, all told. Riddler used to leave clues at all his crime scenes. Always thought he was smarter than the people... Yeah, I do know him. he does leave clues thought we could in use help crime dragging scene. him down. We got a sick pleasure out of taunting us. He was smart enough to slip through our fingers. Yeah, and leave a bloody mess in his wake. Riddler's heyday was a dark time in Gotham. And what we just saw, he hasn't mellowed with age. Uh-huh, get Fernandez on it right away. Commissioner Gordon. Brace yourself. Just so you know, this woman has a lot of juice with the governor. Rub her the wrong way, I could end up on foot patrol till I retire. My people are trained for situations like this, Gordon. We'd have Riddler in custody if you'd only picked up the phone. So, you're the legendary Batman. I've heard a great deal about you. So much so, I don't know if I should believe the hype. And you and all... You are. This is Amanda Waller, director of the agency. What are the feds doing here? Riddler's their case. The GCPD has been asked to open our doors to them. Give them whatever they need. We've been tracking that maniac for some time. No one knows more about him than we do. World-class criminals like Riddler, they're kind of our specialty. Sounds like the expertise we need. Keep that attitude and we'll get along just fine. We're not always welcomed with open arms. Riddler used to be a player in Gotham back when Thomas Wayne and Falcone ran the city. He disappeared so suddenly and for so long Everyone thought he was dead. <laughs> Everyone was wrong. Riddler's back. And if these theatrics are anything to go by, he wants the whole city to know. My people tell me you did some good work handling him, Batman. You and me? I bet we'd make a damn fine team. I heard how you dealt no, with No, you won't. Not to mention that filth, Oswald Cobblepot. Whatever you think you can bring to the table, 
I don't need it. You knew me even a little. You wouldn't hesitate. Trust me, you want me on your side. The only real problem with your setup is who you're working with. Local law enforcement clearly can't cut it. I got a local crime rate says otherwise. <laughs> Ms. Waller... Please, Commissioner. Tear gas. In a hostage situation, we got an ambulance full of civilians with their eyes swollen shut. Not to mention you let Riddler slip through your fingers. You GCPD cowboys clearly don't know what you're doing. That was actually my idea for the tear gas. You're putting gas. all this on me? You're the commanding officer, aren't you? You can't put this on Jim. I called for a distraction. Then maybe you're not as impressive as I thought. I'm here to prevent this incompetence in the future. I gotta get a security detail on Maury while he's in the hospital. Agent Avesta will fill you in on what we know so far. As a token of interdepartmental cooperation. The nerve on her. Don't tell these people a thing, especially about that puzzle. This is our town. We're the ones that'll catch Riddler. Ooh, you thought you was gonna bite your head off for a second. Uh, I'd like to see her try. Special Agent Imana Vesta, Field Intelligence Specialist on the Riddler case. And my partner, Agent Blake. How do you do? I put together this psychological profile of Riddler. You'll see when you read it. He's changed. For your eyes only, <laughs> if you catch my drift. The target of the casino attack, Rumi Mori. Any idea what Riddler wanted with him? We figure it has something to do with why he's back in Gotham. He's a madman. You can't look for reason in someone so clearly deranged. Riddler does show signs of an obsessive compulsive disorder, but he's calculating, fiercely intelligent. I'd be surprised if this wasn't part of a bigger plan. Let me know if you think of anything. It'd be a help. <clears throat> I'm Gotham born and raised, you know. My dad ran a store in the shadow of City Stadium. I just wanted to say it's a real honor to meet you. I do have something I want to ask, though. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? There's something in you that pulls you towards the danger. You can't go two city blocks in Gotham without tripping over criminal scum. Most people just get up and run away. I'm not most people. I think I know you a little better now. I'll be in touch, Agent. Batman, before you go, Gotham's your city. I respect that. But you should know I don't have to play nice. I'm letting you hunt the Riddler for now. You better share everything you find. Or this courtesy call is going to become something you really won't like. You get me? Scabble away. I cannot take that woman anymore. Episode one, the end. That does not say end. Sorry, I can't pronounce that word. You may call me stupid for not pronouncing that word. What an eventful evening. I've taken the liberty of preparing some refreshments. Uh, thanks, Al. I need to focus. Maybe music will help. Classy. The computer is finished scanning the Riddler's puzzle box. It's ready when you are. Let's get to work. Oh, I'm moving. 
Selena. She'll turn up again. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, I hear something from Harvey Dent. You got season two. I'm season one. Once. Seeing In the end, from Harvey can make a single decision one. without consulting his lucky coin. He's in Arkham Asylum now, with the rest of the criminally insane. Oswald Cobblepot, the Penguin, my oldest friend. Vicky Vale, AKA Lady Arkham, driven to madness, leader of the children of Arkham. No explosives detected, no radioactivity. Nothing dangerous at all so far. Computer, run another scan. I want to be absolutely sure this thing is safe. Also, I took the liberty of digging up everything I could find on the agency. There's plenty here. Know your enemy and all that. It, it comes and goes. Ever since the kidnapping and, and all the other business with Lady Arkham. Alfred. <clears throat> no, no, don't you worry about me. No, I, I, I should be fine. It was worse after my first tour of duty. Your family, Alfred. We worry about family. Thank you, Bruce. It'll pass. Working always helps. Riddler terrorized this city long before you were Batman. Gotham's original costumed criminal. Yes, to have him returned, it's unsettling. I remember when he was the scourge of the underworld. Even Carmine Falcone gave him a wide berth. He was presumed dead for so long. Why come back to Gotham? Well, he seemed to have a prior relationship with Mori. Some kind of axe to grind. Let me upload the rest of this to the Codex. The agency realized Riddler was still alive when he orchestrated a prison break at Peña Duro. My men here say you let yourself get caught, Mr. Riddler. Just Riddler. Why willingly turn yourself in? Oh, Mr. Warden, to get everyone else out, of course. That wasn't obvious. The man is deranged. If you ask me, he needs help. He's clearly sick. The man is in urgent need of a doctor. I know just the place for him. Plenty of room at Arkham Asylum. Next to him, most of the inmates seem like a picture of health. What was that? You should see your face. Its confusion is delightful. I think I'll take it with me. <laughs> What does he mean by I that? Take everything back. The agency. The public face of a shadow committee of military leaders, intelligence experts, and government officials. Civil rights violations, domestic black sites, decentralized accountability. This information, it's all before Waller took over the director position. Perhaps she's given them a new direction. Maybe, but the agency's empowered to override local law enforcement with impunity. Oh, that man's got some competition in town. I wonder if we need be worried. We have a common enemy in the Riddler. 
That puts us on the same side. You really are a different Batman these days, aren't you? Silver linings in all things. Well, you warned me about keeping my paranoia down to acceptable levels. Thought I'd give it a try. Let's see what Riddler's little gift is all about. Solve my puzzle soon, or people will get hurt. Uh, Riddler's M.O. hasn't changed in all these years. writing engraved along the rim. I have an eye, yet cannot see. Who am I? That sounds familiar. I've heard it before. Don't happen to remember the answer, do you? Sadly, no. I have an eye, but cannot see. Who am I? Justice. I would release to Batman, maybe. Lady Justice is blindfolded to show she's impartial. She has two yeah. eyes under the blindfold, though. Not one. So it's something else. He gave this to me at a casino. Card games. Maybe a jack. Specifically a one-eyed jack. But he's on the card twice, showing both eyes. Besides, he can still see. So it's probably not that. Eye of a hurricane, eye of a needle. I have an eye book to not see. Oh, and the hurricane, yeah. The eye of a hurricane. It fits the description in the riddle, but I'm not sure how it helps us. Even if there were hurricanes in Gotham, it's hard to imagine one helping us with the object in question. If that is indeed the key. The eye of a needle. But how does that relate to the object in question? Maybe it's telling us how to use it. Uh, sounds very plausible. I thought the hurricane because um, it, I, it has an eye. They cannot see. I was thinking that it has a. It doesn't have no eyes, but it knows what was it's going. Never but forget. that was. That does not relate to the riddle. Needle. A record needle. Oh. Halfway there, Batman. Means you got. Half a chance of stopping a whole lot of pain. To be honest, you're already doing better than I thought. But don't sit around feeling pleased with yourself. Unless you want to see me tear this city apart. Because the weapon needle has... I suppose you're going to look in there. An open invitation from the Riddler? Of course. Huh. Looks like I'm manipulating radio bands or waveforms. The so, needle means uh, I am. I'm not sure what I'm looking actually, at. I don't know what I'm talking about. Displaying. And that sound. What? Oh, uh, I'm not really sure about any of it. Get Lucius on the line, will you? Hey, Alfred. Good morning, Lucius. I hope we're not interrupting your breakfast. My youngest is probably stealing all the bacon, but duty calls. What's up? This is a puzzle from the Riddler. There's a strange waveform pattern I can manipulate inside that needs your expertise. I, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I can meet you at Wayne Tower in a little bit. We'll uh, fire up the R&D lab. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important, Lucius. No, no, don't worry about it. It's actually going to be a big day for me. Tiffany starts at Wayne Enterprises. Tiffany? Really? 
Your daughter working alongside you. How wonderful. Uh, certainly is. Bruce, I'll see you soon. Bye, Lucius. Can't wait to see Tiffany. I'll be at Wayne's house. Good hunting, Bruce. Excellent. I'm glad I caught you. I have some good news to share. Good to hear it, Regina. It's what I've come to expect, with you as Wayne Enterprises chairperson. I just talked to the board, and our stock price has doubled since you took the company back from Oswald Cobblepot. The Gazette's running a piece about it. Look, I would love to hear all the details, but I've got a meeting with Lucius I've got to run to. Well, I don't mean to pry, but what's in that case? Seems like an odd thing to be carrying around the office. Oh, just some tax papers. Accounting is doing an audit or something. Well, you shouldn't have to be burdened with that. I can take them. That's okay. I got it. Well, I've got a meeting I've got to run to. We'll pick up this conversation this afternoon. Sounds great. You're in my chair. Just updating the encryption on your bat tech. But if you want me to stop? No, the seat is all yours. This is the thing you were talking about? One of Riddler's puzzles. Some kind of test. Show me. Huh. Any idea what he's planning? Not yet. That's why I need your help. If his history is anything to go by, he left us a clue. A psychological profile of Riddler. Uh, knowing how his mind works, this should come in handy. No sign of explosives or poison. Already scanned for that in the cave. it's giving off a signal maybe <laughs> i couldn't decipher it. i was hoping you could help with that i'll see what i can do shouldn't take long what is that it's not one of mine think fast whoa hi dad <laughs> tiffany Hey, Bruce. T my God, Tiffany. It's been a while. Sneaking out of orientation your first day? I just wanted to say hi to my new boss. I got you a present. A micro drone prototype I developed in my spare time. High-end AV, stealth black shell, programmable for autonomous observation. Small, quiet, and super smart. Just like its designer. Not bad, huh? You always had a thing for toys. It's so hard to know what to get a man who has everything. I love it. Thanks, Tiffany. Well, I guess it's not bad. Not bad. See what I had to deal with growing up? Huh. There's something different about you. Uh, there is? And I don't just mean what happened to your ear. I can't quite put my finger on it. But you look... You look... You look. I think the uh, the word you're looking for is badass. Um, no, that is definitely not what I meant. I'm the resident badass around here. Thank you very much. <laughs> you just <laughs> said that out loud. Uh, see, Bruce, it's her first day, and I'm already embarrassing her. Interesting. Don't. Too late. Already touching. Just be careful. <laughs> What a strange thing. This circuitry design. 
It's elaborate and unorthodox. Almost intentionally so. Like whoever put it together was kind of showing off. Huh, micro pulse waves? It's just weird. Seriously, what is this thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's like whoever made it. Well, something your dad has been working on. Lucius, care to explain? Oh, it's nothing. Just an old piece of tech that found its way into my lab. But what does it do? That's what we're trying to work out. You guys are lucky I'm here to help. Uh, help with... Figure this freakish thing out. Uh, Tiffany did graduate first in her class at Cornell in molecular engineering. Let me take a crack at it. I can help you get to the bottom of this. Figure out what it does. Are you sure you don't have some place to be? Whatever. I've got to get back to orientation anyway. Have fun scratching your heads. <laughs> All right, then. Time to crack this puzzle. I never told her, you know. Told her what I really do at Wayne Enterprises. What uh, we do. I understand your hesitation about involving her in this Riddler business. But uh, you should consider bringing Tiffany into the fold. Into the mission. If not now, then in the future. We're going to need help. You know how dangerous our business is. I couldn't live with myself if something happened to Tiffany. I'm just gonna have to say no. It's your secret to tell. Yes, it is. May I just say, uh, burdens are lighter when carried by many. Well, shall we go down to the lab? Actually, the equipment we need is down in my office. We'll get this taken care of in no time. Mr. Well, Wayne. Uh, yes? I'm Special Agent Avesta. This is my partner, Special Agent Blake. Uh, well, I guess I'll see you in a bit. I'll be down in my office. Whenever you, uh, get done here. See you later, Lucius. Good chat. Oh, yeah, one of the best. Sorry for the unannounced visit. We're with the agency's behavioral analysis unit. We just came by to ask a few questions. Hold on, guys. Okay, I'm back. And I'm recording this on New Day because the Elgato was glitching because I don't know. I was saying you're a bit of a mystery. What, uh, what is it you want? The agency recently brought me in to draft a psychological portrait of the Riddler. We've been tracking him for months, but haven't been able to find him. Anything I can help with? See, I told like you you'd I be was cooperative. Saying, you know, was glitching and you Agent may... Blake thought you'd be cagey, defensive, you, based I on may the have skipped a little bit of Guess it. Guess he was wrong. My, uh, but my history? Hopefully the a lot of things happened to you again. last year, and not all of them were good. You put yourself at risk when you helped bring in your friend Harvey Dent. He was a violent psychotic at the time. Almost destroyed the city. Come to think of it, you've been associated with quite a few psychopaths over the years. I wouldn't go that far. I would. The criminally insane, they seem drawn to you. Either that, or you're often in the wrong place at the wrong time. I'm not sure I like where this conversation is going. Well, this probably isn't gonna help. I think you'd know him as John Doe. We understand that it was during your stay in Arkham where you and John met and became friends. From the sound of it, you two were close. You've got to be kidding me. He's no friend of mine. That's why you came here to ask me about that guy? According to hospital records, you and John were involved in a riot. They captured the whole incident on video. I saw you flee after John cut another inmate. A man named Victor Zaz. Several people were hurt. 
I wasn't myself at the time, okay? I, I was... Drugged by Lady Arkham. I know the story. John was discharged from Arkham months ago. No one has seen or heard from him since. I was thinking maybe you have. <laughs> Why would you think yeah, that? Yeah, at the end of he season one, you we saw... as his emergency contact. Him. Bar. Sounds like you two were pretty close to me. Sounds like something a crazy person would do. Maybe you made an impression on him. Well, I haven't seen or heard from him, so... Did he do something wrong? He's a person of interest. You see, we've got a wall in the office with a bunch of photos pinned to it. Two-Face, Penguin, Lady Arkham, you know, Gotham's most notorious. They've got all these little strings connecting them to one another, like a web. And you, my friend, like are Spider -Man. at the center. You keep pretty strange company. I'm sorry, I should not wait, make that weapon to everyone to think such a stand-up guy. Game. <laughs> and your point is, I'm pretty sure exactly DC that hates I'm Marvel, and Marvel kind of hates criminal DC. mastermind. Or just really well, then again, unlucky. they didn't make a cost of a comic book. You together. know more than you're letting on, Mr. Wayne. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you don't trust us. Or maybe you're a criminal, like your father. Maybe you're not the hero people think you are. <laughs> You've got the wrong idea. That's an evacuation warning. It's time for you to leave. We'll pick this up another time. yourself out what are you talking what did you figure out i've i've solved the riddler's puzzle bruce uh, riddler really pulled a good one over on us uh, i might still be able to disable it but you just hold tight lucius i'm coming down to help it's too late for that tell tiffany that i love her then i'm sorry i wasn't around more lucius we really made a difference didn't we batman killed and 14 injured after a tragic explosion. The GCPD is opening an investigation into what they are calling an industrial accident. Wayne Enterprises Chief Technology Officer Lucius Fox died last Tuesday in the violent blast. A small service is being held for the tech giant and father of three at Divinity Church this Sunday. there for me, Lucius. From the very beginning. I'm gonna miss you. He was a good man. To lose him like this, it's, it's hard to bear. Lucius helped raise you, Bruce. It was family. Riddler's attack on the casino was one thing. But this... This is personal. We can't let him get away with it. Riddler struck at the heart of our operations and tore a family apart in the process. Riddler so, will did that for what he's done. The Riddler, I swear to you, was that an explosive? I will make him suffer. Maybe it's what's called for, given the circumstances. Of course, it won't bring poor Lucius back. I can't imagine how devastated she must be to lose her father in such a violent way. <laughs> I should go talk to her. Yes. She can use all the support she can get. Hey, <laughs> Tiffany. I still can't believe he's gone. None of this. None of this feels real. Uh, 
I know your dad's in a better place. Maybe. I wouldn't trade places with him. He loved working for you, you know? They hardly saw him at home because of this. Mom used to complain my little brother was growing up without a dad. Now I guess it's true. He was so busy. I can't remember the last time I got to hang out with him. Just father and daughter. Just thought there'd be more time. There were so many things I wanted to talk to him about. I know it's no consolation, but the work your father was doing, it was important. More important than family. That's not what I meant. Well, what did you mean? I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't blame you. Hey, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Just let it out. I'm just trying to wrap my head around it all. I saw his remains, Bruce. Anything left. <laughs> what were you guys working on that could have caused that? It, it doesn't quite add up. Please tell me. For my own sanity. Fine. Just tell me one thing. That weird disc. You were trying to keep me away from it. Was that what killed him? Did you put my father's life at risk for that? I'm begging you. Just tell me that one thing. I need to know. I thought it was safe, Tiffany. I, I really did. I had no idea Lucius could get hurt. Please forgive me. Forgive you? I hope you can forgive yourself. Whatever you got my father into, I will find out. And I will shout it to the world. Okay, I think we made her angry. I should have lied to her. So sorry, really. Such a shame. At least he went out with a bang, oh, right? Oh, yeah, for that, is we that can Joker? all be grateful. You, aka you John Doe, know my father. Whoa, whoa, what the heck? Seriously, Bruce? This guy's with you. I'm so sorry. I will handle this. Jeez, Bruce, that's quite a grip. For sure. What are you doing here? I told you I'd see you again, didn't I? You and me, we're two threads in the same stitch. Look, I, I, I got you a little something just, just to mark the occasion. Uh... Get well soon, John. I knew you'd be hurting, see? I thought it might make you feel better. You think this is funny? My friend is dead. Oh, I got it wrong, didn't I? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Gotta be quiet as church mice, right? <laughs> it hasn't, um... It hasn't been easy for me out here, you know? I'm the new guy now. It's, it's the freedom that gets to you. There's so damn much you hardly know what to do with it. <laughs> it's not like Arkham. 
times I missed those padded walls. You knew where the lines were drawn. Which ones not to cross. It's the best place for you. I'm sure they take you back. Oh, no, Bruce. <laughs> Didn't you know? I'm cured. Dr. Leland says so. It looks so. like you are. Cross my heart. <laughs> Off the meds and everything. If everyone could please take their seats, uh, we will begin. Would you just sit down? Today we gather to honor the memory of Lucius Fox. He was a friend, a father, a husband, a leader. You are crashing my friend's funeral, John. You better have a good reason. Oh, I do. I need that uh, favor you owe me. You know, you, you might have been a little reluctant at the time, but if it wasn't for me, you'd still be in Arkham. You're sleeping off your meds in the rec room with Zaz. You're, you're gonna do right by me, aren't you? I know you're a man of your word. I didn't agree to that. But you did help me out. Friends look out for each other. Am I right? Matthew tells us... You see, I met some inspiring people out here. Made some new friends. Made a kind of pact. They're I don't know why he's in the back. He should be in the front. He was his friend. By their own rules. But they remind me of you. Of your father. So who are they? You'll find out when you meet them. They're looking to bring someone like you into the fold. Maybe you, you will meet them for me, won't you? Please, I've, I've got a lot writing on this. I already told them you would. Please don't let me down. Not a chance, John. I don't know what you're mixed up in, but I am not getting involved. Ooh, disappointing. <laughs> You know, I spoke so highly of you. I told them you'd fit right in. Just makes me want, I don't know, lash out. Shh. Shh. We're here to mourn. Please, you us me again. You'll be mourning the loss of your teeth. How dare you? Oh, easy, easy, John. Take a deep breath, okay? Calm down. Take a chill pill, Joker. You're right. Hmm. Sorry, Bruce, that outburst, it, it's antisocial, I know. Dr. Leland says I have a hard time handling rejection. I think it's the stress. You see, I've got this enemy real piece of work calls himself the Riddler how do you know the Riddler know him I want to rip his eyeballs out he's a thief and a killer and worst of all he's he's rude I tried to let the authorities know the kind of low life they're dealing with but Wait a minute, you know him too. Of course, a man of Bruce Wayne's caliber knows everyone. So I shouldn't be surprised. Uh, uh, just from the news, the guy's clearly a murderer, sick in the head. Don't know the half of it. If I had my way, that smarmy know-it-all would never leave his hole. Leave his hole? You know where he is. No, no, not exactly, no. Maybe I said too much. Tell me where he is. I am not messing around, John. Oh, Bruce, I missed your fire. I really did. Yeah, I, I really don't know much. I heard the egomaniac always made people go to him for meetings. Somewhere in the East End. Where in the East End? 
Honestly, that's all I know. And even that might be out of date. If you're so eager to find him, why don't you let me help you? I'll find out where he is and get back to you. See if I can't find out where that jerk puts his head down. It'd be just like the I got no other choice. I would appreciate well, that, John. That's what friends are for, Bruce. Just meet mine later, like I ask. Look, I think I outstayed my welcome here. I'm, I'm just gonna slip away. Excuse me. I'm sorry. It's, uh... It's been so nice catching up, Bruce. I miss this. This trust between us. I know we'll see each other again soon. Be in touch. Goodbye, Bruce. Until next time. I should have put that tracking device on him. Intriguing Why did I not fellow? do that? Certainly not one for decorum. I don't think that outburst me want to notice. It feels like I want to change my choice. John. He gave me a lead on Riddler's location. Inform Gordon. Tell him to drag up GCPD records on Gotham's East End. And tell him we're on Riddler's trail. I was wondering what Bruce Wayne pulled out in his pocket. Enjoying the view? Eh, hard to do these days. There's one thing for the bad parts of town to get uglier. But when places you know, like Wayne Tower choices, start falling apart, I made makes you wonder what's next. Um, later after yeah, I bet Bruce Wayne is wondering the same so. thing. Seems like the world's got it out for that guy. Spend some time in Arkham, gets drugged through the dirt by the media for something he didn't do. Finally picks himself up, and what happens? Someone bombs his company. Bruce Wayne picked himself up once. He could do it again. He certainly showed us that much, didn't he? You said you had a lead on Riddler. Hiding somewhere in the East End. Why am I not surprised? East End's been a no man's land since Harvey Dent blew it up. I've tried to get more patrols out there, but City Hall's not given up the funds. The area between 42nd and 48th, more or less lawless. That narrows down the surge at least. construction site at the center of 46th. Abandoned. Harvey's boys demolished that area, chasing the children of Arkham. There's nothing but a crater there. Not really a place for Riddler to have a hideout. The land at the end of 44th was recently purchased anonymously. Well, the only thing there is an old water tower. Hmm. Something feels fishy about that. My gut tells He's not me that's just fish in the water tower. Uh, nice work, Batman. If this lead pans out, Waller will have to eat her words. <laughs> Whatever you said to her at the casino really got up her nose. I have to tell you, I got a bad feeling about her. How so? The way she goes after criminals. She's ruthless. Puts her people at risk. And believe me, she doesn't let due process getting her way so stop at nothing and i mean nothing to get her man that doesn't sit right with me as far as law enforcement goes jim you were the best of it i don't know many cops with as much heart as you uh, i appreciate you saying that waller she doesn't see that as a strength i was ordered to give her updates on breaks in the riddler case well, if there's a chance he's there, we should probably let her know. Don't want to give her ammunition with the governor. She's already got him breathing down my neck about what went down at the casino. Notify Waller. She's proven useful so far. Just be careful around her, huh? She moved her people into my downtown precinct without so much as a please or thank you. I tell you, Batman, she keeps on chipping away at my authority. I'm gonna crack. 
Then let's find Riddler before it comes to that. I'll have my people call her people on the way. Riddler won't feel so clever after we come back. I told Waller about our lead on this place. She's caught up in briefings, can't get here for a while. She said she appreciates the cooperation. Not exactly cozy, is it? Let's see what we can learn. Okay. Someone's keeping a scrapbook. Vane, isn't he? Monkey statue. See no evil. Oh, see no Hear evil. Heal no evil. Speak, Speak no, no evil. evil. I know a friend had these th monkey statues once. I saw. Well, I know. Uh, no, I, well, God damn it! It's it's stuck. No way to open it from the inside. Then how do we get out? We go in. After you. Okay. Well, give me a good, honest crack house any day. Special Agent Mario Fernandez. Holy crap. Mario, He's one of Wallers. As in Super Mario? You want to mind? The man bit his tongue clean through. He must have suffered a shock or a sudden jolt. One of his pupils is fully dilated, the other's contracted. A clear sign of brain trauma. Huh. There's no sign of a blow to the head. His ear? There's some hemorrhaging from the ears. His eardrums must have burst. He was trying to call for help. The phone isn't getting a signal. Damn it. Me either. It's feet. One shoe is missing. The sole of the other one's almost completely melted through. Okay, what? Oh. He's missing parts of his fingers on the right hand. We saw this before. The victim in the casino. That's a hell of an invitation. Riddler is playing games. Bet he tried to play along. We can learn from his mistakes. Let's find out what he did wrong. Well, I'm not getting inside that thing until I investigate what happened. Scratches on the monitor. The polarizing filter has been tampered with. Like in sunglasses. Monitors typically have a polarizing filter to reduce reflection. I don't see anything. Impossible to see with the naked eye. We're going to have to look at it through a polarized lens.
one shoe we know where, melted. Where his shoe went. Those belong to poor Cinderella over there. missing their senses like the monkey statues you're right uh, that the there must be a thing. connection hmm. kill no evil see no evil speak no evil there are bleeds inside and a lot of blood huh we know riddler likes penalizing his victims for wrong answers Safes with electronic locks. <sighs> Shut tight. These must be the goal of whatever game we're playing. Okay, if maybe if I link this to here. Can't see how those you know. monitors are connected to the safe. Another one of Riddler's sick contraptions. Some kind of murder box, I guess. Well, he was always a wacko, but this takes it to a new level. The glass. It's polarized. So it is. Won't budge. Must be locked in place. Turn me round, but not the right way, and you might live to see another day. What does it mean? It's still warm. There must be some kind of heating element underneath. This thing is built like an oven. You could be cooked alive in there. Maybe if I connect this to the melted shoe, maybe that would make a lot of sense. The floor of the box heated up while the agent was inside. He tried standing on one foot to save the other, causing that shoe to catch on fire. When he exited the box, he tried to put the fire out, but couldn't. So he threw off his shoe. Answer in one of these safes. He chose the wrong one. Cost him his fingers. Hey, I got a hunch. Come here. No matter how careful Riddler is, chances are good he hasn't scrubbed his own computer. Good call. It's worth checking out. I recognize some of the names on this list. They're all Waller's people. Names, addresses, phone numbers. We have to warn her. First, we have to get out of here. Um. Mori, he sold technology to Riddler. When I talk about strange bedfellows. You know, Waller's been keeping pretty tight tabs on Mari for a while now. She must have known. What does it say? Riddler's not working alone. Just wonderful. More psychos to worry about. He and his colleagues. They don't see eye to eye. Apparently they don't like his beef with me. Hey. Maybe we'll get lucky, they'll kill each other. Wait. 
What's this? Prototype of the trap he used on Mori. The armor, extremely sturdy. Ensuring there's no possible way to open them other than solving his riddles. This is an insane way to commit crimes, even for this city. Metal mesh lining the walls. Riddler has converted this entire place into a giant Faraday cage. Faraday what? An enclosure designed to block electromagnetic fields. No signals in or out. Guess it explains why our phones aren't getting signals. Clever son of a bitch. Since the monitors have been tampered with, it's likely there's a message on it. One that can only be seen with a polarized lens. You won't know until you're inside the box, though. Could be a... Could be a trap. Okay, so... What else am I supposed to do? Oh. statues. I'm starting to sense a theme here. That's an agency issue pistol. Packs a hell of a jolt. I saw it take down Riddler's goons at the casino. It was impressive. Gotta give it to Waller. Her people have great tech. Take a look at this. Huh. Well, that's the same kind of body cam the GCPD issues its officers. Maybe there's a clue on the recording. Can't hurt to look. Because you've been so candid with me, I'm giving you a chance your other comrades won't get. A chance at getting out of this alive. We'll catch you. The agency, they'll find... I shouldn't have to remind you that you've been chasing me for years. And I've always been two steps ahead. If you win the game, I'll let you go free. And you'll get a consolation prize. An exclusive sneak peek into how I'm going to kill all of your colleagues. <laughs> now how is that for motivation? Screw you! Oh. He had the agent bound while he beat him. You got a VR in that cowl or something? Something like that. I've got all the pieces of Riddler's puzzle. Now I need to know what order they happened in. Okay, so... Probably, probably Thinking about nope. this whole the agent woke up here where his body yeah. cam fell off. Once he found he couldn't call Chamble. for help, he saw the message on the monitors and willingly put himself inside the murder box. The agent's shoe caught fire inside the murder box, so he opened it in a panic. As soon as he was out of the box, he ripped off the burning shoe and threw it. Somewhere in the confusion, he must have missed something crucial. From where he lost his shoe, the agent beeline for the wall of safes. He opened one, but chose poorly. The blade sliced off his fingers. And there he met his end. Though it's still unclear how and when his eardrums could have burst. The agent made a number of mistakes. Mistakes we can avoid. The heat inside the box forced him to run out before he... Before he could get Riddler's next clue. Poor bastard couldn't withstand the heat. The bat suit's armor is heat resistant. It'll buy me more time to find Riddler's next clue. Getting inside the box and starting the game. 
is the only way we're getting out of here. This is insane. You know that, right? The last man who went in there is dead. There's a good chance it'll kill you, too. Maybe you'd like to go in and solve it yourself. No, go ahead. I wouldn't want to steal your thunder. Oh, that's the phone, if y'all are feeling that. I'm just going to avoid that. It's rising, Batman. see trouble and one tells no lies. Ask the third if he hides the prize. The monkeys. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. But which one is he referring to? Whichever one it is, the correct safe will have a face with those senses removed. Speak no removed. evil. Ask the I'll dud. Check. The dud monkey is speak no evil. Ah, damn it. It's still locked shut. They should unlock when I open this door. Ultrasonic device. Let's test it out, shall we? The riddle! Use it to open the safe! I'll put a stop to this damn noise! Oh my god, whatever's in that safe better be worth all this pain. A missile? It's a homing missile. What does it home in on? Looking at its schematics now. A signal. A radio signal. A signal. That's. That's how he died. How who died? That's how they'll all die. Riddler. Maury sold me missiles for all of my enemies. Everyone on my list gets one. Most won't even know what's coming. For a brief second, their dull existences will light up. I'm closing in on you, Riddler. We escaped your twisted puzzle. It's only a matter of time before I find you. Time is one thing you don't have. I'm trying to get a handle on you, Batman. Partnering with Gordon is one thing. From what I remember of the old days, he's harmless enough. Yeah, we'll see about that when you're in cuffs. But the Agency, they're a natural enemy to people like you and me. You must be desperate if you're making friends with them. You must be really up against the ropes to want that government scum in your corner. Stopping you is all I care about. I'll do whatever it takes. <laughs> we'll see. Just know that there's a cost to doing business. The Agency uses people, Batman. Corrupts them, breaks their minds. 
I wasn't always like this. The agency made me. Oh, this is garbage. Yeah, Waller's a hard ass, sure, but she had nothing to do with why he's so messed up. I didn't say Waller, did I? This goes way before her time. But I don't forget. That's the thing about having a mind like mine. You remember everything. Save your sob story for jail. I'm not interested. You think I want sympathy? This is my city. I was running things in Gotham before you could walk. I just wanted to see if the man who claims he fights for justice is really as good as he believes. But then, you already answered that for me, didn't you? When you offloaded my puzzle on your friend. Why don't you tell Gordon here what happened to Lucius Fox? Watch out, Commissioner. For all his preaching, Batman knows when to sacrifice a pawn to win the game. It was a smart move. Getting out of the way of the blast. Something only a pragmatist would do. You shouldn't have said his name, Riddler. I'll make you pay for what happened to Lucius. That must be the guilt talking. After all, the poor man's death is on you. Look at Gordon. He doesn't know what to make of any of it. Trust is hard-earned, yet easily lost, isn't it? Come on now. Don't get your tights in a twist. I knew you weren't sharp enough to do it on purpose. There's no room at the top for schoolboys who are too squeamish to fight in the gutter. You don't have what it takes to be a player in this town. Not without giving up those values you hold so dear. Game on! Wow. The game is on. I'll wait for a while and pass on what we found. She won't be happy when she finds out Riddler knows about every agency operative in Gotham. I don't blame her. If they were my cops, no one would be sleeping till we found this Riddler guy. Just keep your eyes open, Jim. In the meantime, I'll stay on Riddler's tail. Hey, hey, hold up a sec. What Riddler said in there about the agency, smoke and mirrors, you ask me. But the thing about Lucius Fox and the blast at Wayne Tower... You gotta level with me. You got some connection with that Wayne Tech guy you didn't tell me about? Riddler loves playing mind games, Jim. This was one of them. Don't fall for it. You expect me to buy that? You've never lied to me before. I don't like it. I gotta say, the fact I had to learn about it from Riddler instead of you, I doesn't sit right with me at all. I thought we had some trust, you and I. What do you expect me to do with this? Am I just supposed to sit on my hands? I already told you. It's a mind game to drive a wedge between us. Believe it or don't, Jim. I just got this funny feeling. Well, I guess if it's your word against Riddler, there's only one option. I mean, I wasn't born yesterday. I know you probably have a network of civilians working for you. You can't do the kinds of things you do without a gigantic support system. I'm uh, sorry. I guess Riddler's getting in my head after all. Batman. Uh... I'll be waiting to hear from you. Okay, I think back back there I made the wrong choice because I was seeing the symbols. I thought I saw the man covering his mouth and it was speak no evil. I didn't see the symbols for that please. I heard your discussion with Commissioner Gordon. It sounded like he believed you, that Lucius Fox's death has nothing to do with the Batman. Still, Gordon's dangerously close to figuring out who you are. If he does find out, I have no idea how he'll react. 
It's not a chance you can afford to take. You're right. Jim's a fine detective. It's no surprise he's getting close to the truth. We'll have to be on our guard. You were radio silent for so long. Tell me, did you find out how Lucius died? This is a missile I found in Riddler's workshop. The explosion at Wayne Tower. We were thinking about it all wrong. The puzzle wasn't an explosive. It was an emitter. When it was solved, it emitted a signal. You heard it earlier. If allowed to play too long, it becomes a launch signal. Dear God! You did solve the box. We just didn't know it. The Batcave Scrambler blocked the signal. Poor Lucius. Wayne Tower offered no such protections. Our tight little family has gotten smaller because of it. It was the three of us looking out for each other. Now it's two. With Lucius gone, so we need to find someone Lucius to take over his role. No one could ever fill his shoes. But, but you're right. Between the Lady Arkham affair and losing Lucius in this gruesome fashion, it's clear we're up against a new class of criminal. This war of ours, it may be too much for us on our own. The list of agency operatives from Riddler's workshop. He plans to do the same thing to them. It's a hit list. It's only useful if he has a way to target the agents, though. And I doubt he's sending them all puzzle boxes. Hold on, let's just walk through it. He's hacked their cell phones. He could pinpoint the location of any one of these operatives. And he can broadcast his signal through their phone to make them a target of a missile strike. Oh, shoot. Can you block it? If I can get a clean copy of the signal, yes. It's the only way I can get a clean version of the signal. It's pretty grim, Alfred. You don't have to watch. I can handle it. I've never been one to shy away from duty, however unpleasant it may be. Of course you can. Let's get this over with. Bruce, get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've... I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. He knew he was going to die. Oh. Can you switch to audio only, please? Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius? We really made a difference, didn't we? Batman? Uh, I, 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 I shouldn't have watched this. I'll, uh, I'll go get that tea, Master Bruce. All right. Now I just need to create a filter to get a clean version of the signal, and then match up the points found in both sound files. Two sounds have to be the same. Bruce? Bruce! The waveforms match. Tiffany. Tiffany. That's a match. There. I've piggybacked on a Riddler's cell phone hack. 
They'll recognize any incoming signal match and shut down, negating a launch. Makes sense for me to have the signal on me as well. What for? Riddler still has functioning missiles. Once he finds out I've blocked his targets, he may decide to launch indiscriminately. But with the signal, I might be able to divert them. Tiffany gave me this the day Lucius died. Let's put it to good work. It's not a theory I really want to test. So we had better find Riddler first. There is always Riddler's second in command. Eli Nabel, arrested after his attack on the casino. None of the authorities have gotten anything out of him yet. Unknown contact. What is it? That John guy from the funeral from Arkham. Who actually sounds like he's keeping his word. Mm. Mori, huh? John thinks that Mori can get us Riddler's location. Do you believe him? Maybe we should go back to the beginning. Bring Rumi Mori up on the back computer. Either of them could potentially lead me to him. The question is, which is more likely to help you? Hmm. Mori's a businessman. Given the right incentive, he could be persuaded to talk. He sure can't have any love for Riddler after his attempted murder at the casino. I'd say he'd respond better to a more genteel approach. Peer to peer as Bruce Wayne. However, the agency is watching him. If Waller finds out that Bruce Wayne sought a parley with Mori, she'll not be best pleased. On the other hand, Riddler's lieutenant, Eli Nabel, took a go at me in the casino, put up quite a fight. Cracking him will be tougher, more physical. Certainly a job for Batman. He's currently in Waller's custody in a GCPD holding cell. Interrogating Nabel there would be a visible endorsement of Waller's authority. Gordon won't like it. So go as Bruce Wayne to the businessman or go, go to Batman as the... Eli, more, uh, more or I'll be with Maury. Maury. I'm sure Bruce Wayne can find a way to reason with him. We're back at the casino. Waller's people are here, watching Mori. Riddler's agency data should make him easy to tag. I need you to keep an eye on him for me. Maybe cause a distraction if I need it. They're following his every move. Gotta be careful here. All this attention must be annoying to a man like Mori. I see them. All of these agents were on Riddler's list. Even without access to their phones, he'll still try to kill them all somehow. Do whatever it takes to find him, Bruce. I never want to see another video like the one with Lucius. No time to waste.
Mr. Wayne, to what do we owe this honor? Good evening, Mr. Morey. I've come to talk. Your visit is unexpected, Mr. Wayne. What can I do for you? A private matter between friends. We have a mutual enemy, Mori. He can't go unchecked. Men like you and I have many enemies, Mr. Wayne. I am sure we share more than one. You know the one I mean. The authorities are watching my every move. Apparently, I'm a person of interest. There's really not much I can offer you, yeah, you other are. than a drink and a seat at the roulette wheel. Not while I'm being shadowed. We need privacy. Lose the agents. Done. They just got an order to sweep the perimeter. Should give you a couple of minutes at least. Impressive, Mr. Wayne. <laughs> we haven't even scratched the surface. What can I do for you? Information. About the Riddler. Why would I do that? You're on his list, Maury. He's gonna hit you with the same weapons you sold him. You and a lot of other people. I dealt with that maniac, it's true. But I was done after the first delivery. Riddler wanted more. Everything he could get his hands on. He even wanted me to hand over one of my biotech companies. I said no. That's why he attacked you. You have no idea how crazy he is. I only wish I had known it sooner. You have no idea how crazy I am. It's in your eyes, Mr. Wayne. You're dangerous. I don't think the Riddler knows who he's up against. I want you to know. I had no idea the Riddler had marked you as a target. I knew your father back when he was running Gotham. Our interests often aligned. I would never dishonor his memory. Hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm back. He was a friend. Truly one of a kind. Then you owe me. For my father's sake. <laughs> that was a long time ago. And favors go both ways. I can help you find the Riddler, Mr. Wayne. I sold him the missile array he's using to pick off his enemies. He won't be very far from it. Everything you need to find him is on that drive. But I need a favor from you first. A favor? Walla has me detained here pending Riddler's trial. She controls all my accounts. I need to get out of the country, and in all haste, you can help with that. Otherwise, I fear my fate is a short, miserable life in a black prison. I could do that for you. I knew I could count on your friendship. A chartered plane waits for me at the airport. The pilot will fly me to a safe haven in the Caribbean for the right price. All you have to do is authorize a transfer. You don't want me as an enemy, Mr. Wayne. Surely not. Our agency friends will be back any second. Let's handle this quickly and without disturbance. Done. Send me a postcard from the beach. Thank you, Mr. Wayne. I owe you a great debt. If this ever comes to light, I'll keep your name out of it for as long as I can. Thank you. Be careful, Mr. Wayne. That lunatic is not to be trifled with. No, I suggest you make yourself scarce before our agency friends return. Alfred, I've sent you Maury's information. Find me Riddler's location, and fast. The Lady of Dublin. Which is? A cargo ship in Gotham Bay. Good. Send me the location. And let Gordon know. Tell him Batman's on the way. Okay, 
so it looks like we're going to a shipyard, I think. Okay, no, it's the... It's a bridge. I was mistaken. Armed men on board. This must be it. Be careful, Bruce. Who knows what the Riddler has up his sleeve? Okay, I see a trap. Like, okay. Hostages. They appear to be more of Waller's agents. Yeah, this, these are the. De those are the de we some death him. chambers. Mori's information turned out to be accurate. Well, no sight of the missiles yet, though. I don't know what I'm saying. They must be here somewhere. Decisions. Your agency has been on a good spot for cover. I'll give it to you. Relentless. I'll admit it's going to feel satisfying to get my revenge on your predecessors. Even if you're really just a small part of my plan. So, what are you talking about? Wait You'll see what it. I mean soon, of course. They might be angry. Don't want him raising an alarm. But I'll they understand move when he why isn't they'll recognize my brilliance. <laughs> After all, I am uniquely qualified to see the big picture. It's often a struggle making people see that. You think? I'm sure you you brought this on yourselves. All of you. You government clogs really thought you were smart and it's clear you're in desperate need of some schooling. Whoa. My friends will be here soon. I keep your mouths shut until then. Hostages first. When they're safe, I can find the missiles. Targeting online. Ready, Bruce. You can't possibly think clunking a few heads is enough to make me roll over. Oversized <laughs> vermin! I've memorized your playbook, Batman. I know all your shallow tricks. Maury was incapable of learning his lesson. I knew he'd lead you to me eventually. All part of the plan. The missiles. Bait. Just like the hostages were bait. I knew you couldn't bear to let these agents die. <laughs> you care too much about the little people. 
That makes you weak. I saw how you saved Mori. I saw how angry you got about what happened to Fox. Don't think my compassion means I won't hurt you. Don't think I won't beat you within an inch of your life. Hard to do that when you're in a cage. Even harder when you're dead. My partners were supposed to be here to see this. I guess I can just show them the bodies. I'm going to ask you three questions. Get them wrong, one of these agents gets torn apart. You won't get away. Oh no. You get them right? This happens! I designed this for you, Batman. Gotham's champion of justice will die in an unfair puzzle. Let's get started. We have a lot to get through. I'm curious to see how you'll handle it all! Ask your questions, Riddler. Let's get this over with. Oh, good. I was hoping you'd cooperate. But I don't think the agent next to you shares your enthusiasm. You can handle the sonic blasts. But her... I estimate three blasts at most before her insides rupture. This one should be easy, Batman. Close to the heart. I solved a puzzle box for the bat. Now I'm dead. And I mean dismembered. Closed casket for sure, kind of dead. Who am I? If you know the answer, please say it. My colleagues will die otherwise. Speak up, Batman. Which one of your dead friends am I? Lucius. What was that? I couldn't hear you. Lucius Fox. Very good, Batman. You saved a life. But... <sighs> Thank you. Batman, don't answer any more of his questions. No, Blake. I won't let you die. Number two. Also completely self-evident. I am black and blue and bleeding from the ears. Who am I? Oh no. I think... I think he means me. Say it. Don't you dare answer that! Please, don't let him die. Say it! I need an answer. Avesta. Oh. The answer this is, is Agent really Avesta. You got it, Batman! Ha! Here's your prize! Oh no. Come on! What have you done? Enough, Riddler. You made your point. Just one more, Batman. And then it'll all be over. I'll distract him. Just get us out of here. I'm the sharpest mind you'll ever meet. The original genius with Gotham at my feet. Who am I? You're Riddler. Riddler's the genius. Well done, Agent. You answered so quickly, you almost deserve not to get the blast. Okay, what? What am I supposed to do? Healing dad. Where did I leak it to? Okay, the back. I'll on. fire one of the missiles. Fire the missile. Use the bad cam to make it target the cage. There's no way I'm gonna let nobody die. And use Riddler's trap to protect Iman and myself from the explosion. I like what you're saying, Agent Avesta, but you're not the one I need to hear it from. Missile armed, ready to fire. Who's the genius, Batman? Who's on top of Gotham now? I want to hear it from you. I am. What are you doing? No, 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 no! 
Don't you? You, you don't. Who's got no time left? The Riddler. Thought you'd get such an easy one right. Those missiles are aimed right at the city. The answer is Batman. Can't be happening. Soccer kick him. We caught the riddle, I think. No, he may he may escape. Like we may put him in jail, but he may escape later. Or well, Paul may be facing someone new. Hey, Mom. Batman. Thank God. I I didn't think I didn't think we were going to make it. I I thought. You put yourself on the line for your friends. You saved them. Agent, are you okay? My ears! I can't hear! Oh no. It's going to be okay, Yaman. It's over, Riddler. Look forward to a padded cell. Well... Congratulations, Batman. You managed, even in my twisted game, to keep everyone alive. <laughs> but at what cost? Agent Investus suffered. So no one had to die. That can't sit well with you. Can it? Must be an uncomfortable feeling. Iman knew the risks. She would have endured anything to bring you down. Sounds like you have good things to say about her. If only she could still hear you. I made you hurt an innocent woman to get to me. <laughs> oh, my comrades would have been impressed. I set this all up to show them. I thought they'd back me up, even if they didn't agree. They... They left me here to deal with you alone. They... They betrayed me. You need, you need better, better friends. friends. The term thick as thieves. It's a lie. I need smarter friends. They were all so small-minded. None of them had vision. Unless 
Pass that white-faced prick set me up. Never told them to meet me here. You mean Joker? Wait, what's happening? He... I... the ship down and radio for more medics. But Riddler, is he? Oh, God damn it. Oh, this isn't good, Batman. The investigation is a dead end without a breathing suspect. We're in trouble. A lot of trouble. I have no idea how we're getting out of it. I saved lives today, Jim. That's a victory. Now that counts for something, sure. But it's not enough to keep the gods at bay. Oh, Waller is gonna come down on us like a thunderbolt. Thunderbolt? I'm the whole goddamn hurricane. I'm about to blow <laughs> both you your are. asses off the side of this ship. This is a goddamn mess. Agent Avesta is deaf. Riddler is dead. And I don't know exactly how. But I know you tampered with my suspect at the casino. Unless you expect me to believe that Mori got out of Gotham all by himself. Batman is clearly being misused as an asset to the GCPD. I'm taking direct control of law enforcement in Gotham, effective immediately. What? Gordon, you're being relieved of your stars. Bumped down to deputy ops. You can't demote me. I just did. Don't like it? Go cry to the governor. I generously let this cowboy crap with the Batman go on out of respect. Gordon's not to blame. I was on the scene first. This is my fault, and mine alone. I'm getting to you. Yo, this is Take That's some vacation changed. days, Gordon. I've got sensitive case details to discuss with Batman. We're still in this together, Batman. This doesn't change a thing. This city is about to find itself in a crisis the likes of which it's never known. Riddler had a crew. Not just any crew. The worst criminal minds from all over the world, here in Gotham. You come across anything about them? I'm assuming you've heard of them by now. Let me know if you have anything to share. There's a guy, calls himself John Doe. He's either a member you know or he Maybe knows he who is. That him, confirms some hey, theories we had. That Doe's a one-time patient needle. of another member of the group. Maybe that was someone else. Dr. Harleen Quinzel, former psychiatrist. Harleen? She's very elusive. Keeps her head down. Much more so than that show-off regular. Harleen Quinn? He was going to be my way oh, in no, I know once we is, captured him I know what this is heading towards. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line. And knows exactly when to cross it. Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce Wayne. <gasps> he knows? She knows? She knows my true ident Bruce's true identity. She is really she is really that smart. You and her left island. Help Joe become hopeful. Yes, 
Yeah. about your connection to Lucius. I just lied to him. You can't handle the truth. Who do you choose to visit? Molly and like, oh, that other guy. I chose Molly because, um, I don't know. How did you get the drive from him? I made a deal with Molly. You say, bro. That's why I'm in order to save the other agents. Mm. Not now. Okay, it looks like that's it. So, I wonder what's going to happen next time on the Batman episode. They mentioned Holly Quinn, so hopefully we get to see her. So, that's it guys. Be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.